Hello and namaste. Welcome to another series of U.S. College Guide for Nepali. Uh, today, actually, in this video, I'm going to talk about um, how to apply for economic hardship. And this was the Otherwise Employment Authorization Document, a EAD card, okay, for self like any SF F1 student. Okay? Uh, actually, this is a part of me converting all those uh, text documents which are posted in UNHN actually into videos because I want to make it the data bank, right, YouTube man, so that it's easy for some people to actually uh, watch the video or to listen to this talk, right, and hopefully they will get some idea if they can read, right. Um, so I'm going to go a little more over the, a little more over about the whole process, right, on the actually economic hardship queue, they can get economic hardship eligibility criteria, and then we'll talk about the process and then what after that, right? Um, so basically, economic hardship, it's an inability of a student, F1 student, uh, to deal with the situation due to an unforeseen circumstance, right? So most likely it is a financial situation, right? Economic hardship on everything, right? Basically, it's a uh, circumstance that you can put on a circumstance, loss of financial aid, put on a circumstance, let me before I turn. Okay, I'm watching a ton of right? Um, so I'm going to be looking into documents. Loss of finance related by on campus employment co unavailability, right? This is which is something that a lot of people haven't thought about, right? That's something you could actually use to apply for EAD too, right? It might be difficult, but you can apply for it, right? This is the increase in tuition of the well living cost, didn't say unforeseen, right? After no control, my Zunjun's finally. To put all of that, it's economically difficult. So you can actually apply for EAD. But the way it is going is, of course, that's how I can say approved. Need it? Say it's more likely for natural calamities, or disaster, or what type of ill. Okay. At this point, what can we do? We can talk about more. Right? Especially in Nepal condition, ma. Uh, Nepal earthquake boy, right? This was a disaster boy. This is a politically unstable. So this was the body boy was the boy, right? Uh, almost thought I could put a flooding boy, uh, which could be some of the circumstances you could actually present in your document. Right? That all depends on you and how you make those documents. Right? Basically, for USCIS, my no, basically EAD or the employment authorized and apply one of like you should be a full time F1 student right? uh, for at least one year. Uh, that's how you came to stay, you know, apply for visa bound the head with the circumstances to when you should have prior disclosure one for you, right? Which would make it difficult for you to actually get visa, right? So that's why a lot of people say Miru Sapai Poisa, Yatsa, you know, Nama to land the hair, supply got a visa layer, I run, you know. Which is totally fine. I did it too, you know. And I appreciate the gig on it. That's why I'm saying eligibility one year work. At least one year, some other the pilot lagi pay salary sufficient. You know, so more likely this video is going to benefit sophomores to seniors, right? But it's okay to uh, freshmen too. This is a good thing that you can actually learn about this while I live, you know. So that maybe in the future you can plan how to apply for it. Right? This with the our eligibility criteria mostly seen is in your interest directly actually favor one, you know. So you have to go through international director. So most likely, I would recommend if you have a very good academic standing, right? On a full-time college, you need boy. That's a given name boy. Talk for this, right? Full-time student who status more than boy, right? Now this was the other criteria also. Right? Employment aid is law suppose EAD authorized boy, right? Then EAD employment authorization should not interfere with your studies, right? present studies, right? Don't uh, say. Definitely because the EAD is given to you because they want you to Poisa come on like EAD they go in technically they're giving you EAD so that you can support your study of the finances at house okay? So they are trying to ease your finances right? So EAD is saying they were eligibility criteria that they were this was the uh, basic most important EAD for uh, Eligibility one right? you should be able to demonstrate that employment say the necessary sir, and the employment no way can say garu sir, right? Circumstances management. Okay. Our first step, kya karna hai? Munda kari, you actually go and 
process wise mate you actually go and talk with your uh, HR sub director HR sub director DSO for Mazani you schedule an interview or a session and this will say go and talk to them why what do you want to do you know and make it convincing because sometimes they know that if you're bullshit uh, they will pretty much know so make it convincing the story you know and this was a tell me hey malays the sir mali yedi apply i have two choices either get out and now be out of status or apply yedi and i could apply for work and this was see i could support my studies right this the whole convincing evidence for me jun we'll talk more right jun mali mani sari na chok kala miti haru te or ko paper haru banaune let me see what else this was the pura gare pachi ke huncha bhane yedi let's suppose your dios actually already have you tracking for that status then let's say actually yes one you know you also know i 20 usle certain documents or my certain jun jun possible next one or so jun uscs mo pathaun he could ask or he could he or she could ask or they could not ke ke huncha bhane usle chai i 20 chai ule service ma update garcha hai service ma ke update gardincha bhane chai page 2 i 20 ma chai ke huncha bhane recommendation ma chai employment authorization ko lai recommendation bhanera i 20 magai dincha I don't know why I was I don't know also international office ma this was the I feel jane I don't design gun that's your current I don't know I don't know because our next step ke garnu huncha bhane aba chai process start garnu hero ke bolla hai USCIS ko lai aile samaj college ma bhai rakhyo aba USCIS ko lai ko ke ke chahiyo bhanda keri tyo I765 hai employment authorization ko document huncha jun jun chai ma pani ya actually online ma ma hero pani chhe So I-765 is basically very easy two-page document, right? Sign on it, then this is how. Basically, I am applying for permission to accept employment money. Then so there's an option. And you could actually sit down with your DSO and actually do this too, right? Ani, this one you have option one. It's a nine B. I guess I will provide your social security number one. Then so, just say if employment is fine, then also my social security can apply for it. So, ani, so this is one step, okay? एक एवटा तेरह दुटा निशान हो सोशल सिक्युरिटी भी अप्लाई कर यही प्रोसेस थ्रू कर आई मिन टू से ईएडी अप्लाई कर रही सोशल सिक्युरिटी लिने हो बट ईएडी हेल्प्स यू टू एक्चुअली गेट सोशल सिक्युरिटी के सोशल सिक्युरिटी अप्लाई कर सजिलो भाई क्या बेबी नाइन बी में के सोशल सिक्युरिटी प्रोवाइड कर भाई होता आई सेवेन सिक्स फाइव में आई एम नट गन गो इन टू डिटेल्स आई एम जस्ट एक्सप्लेन लिटल बेट अफ स्टफ हि हई बिकज द फॉर्म इट्स अफ इज प्री सफ एक्सप्लेनटरी हई भर सकता इसमें के इलेवेन में कंसेंट टू डिस्क्लोजर भैने तो फर्म में हाई जो में आई अथोराइज डिस्क्लोजर अफ इन्फर्मेशन फ्रम दिस एप्लीकेशन टू द एस एस आई रिक्वायर्ड फर द पर्पज अफ असाइनिंग मी एस एस एन एंड इस्यू मी अ सोशल सिक्युरिटी कार्ड हो तेज मैं यस करने माथि डू यू हेव सोशल सिक्युरिटी भाई नो भाई है तो भाई के आफ्टर यू गेट ई आई डी यू कैन टेक द एप्लीकेशन सोशल सिक्युरिटी एप्लीकेशन फर्म भर रि लगे सोशल सिक्युरिटी अफिस में गए सोशल सिक्युरिटी भी पाइन जो विच गन बी थ्री फोर मंथ्स आफ्टर यू अप्लाई फर ई आईडी है अप्लाई कर रन मिलियो है सो अब मे भे आई सेवेन सिक्स फाइव भो हई आई सेवेन सिक्स फाइव इट्स प्रिट इजी बेसिकली होता मेलिंग एड्रेस आपको इन्फर्मेशन सब मेरिचल स्टैब्लिश हो सो जेन्डर कंट्री अफ सीटिजनशिप नेशनलिटी नेपाली राख भैन प्लेस अफ बर्थ टाउन अफ बर्थ सब पासपोर्ट में जे सब राख्ने मदर नेम थे सब भाई एलियन रेजिस्ट्रेशन नंबर मांग जो एलियन रेजिस्ट्रेशन नंबर यू विल फाइंड इन पासपोर्ट ए इजी सरी टक फैस्ट ट्रेन मेक दिस भिडियो सोल्ट जैसे एकदम ठूल लमो भिडियो भैर दिस विज इ बेसिकली यू जो साइन द डकुमेंट हई अंत आई सेवन सिक्स फाइव एंड मेक श्योर यू सो टू यू डीएसओ मैं भाई सके इट्स बेस्ट आइडिया अफ विथ सिट डाउन विथ द डीएसओ एंड टक टू दम इफ नट ट्राई टू फाइन सैंपल आई सेवेन सिक्स फाइव फर एफ एम स्टूडेंट भाई यू प्राउड विल फाइन हई दिस विज मैं अगे भे आई ट्वेंटी जो अपडेट आई ट्वेंटी जो मैं रेकमेंडेशन फर एम्प्लोयमेंट अथोराइजेशन भर लेखे राख्ने हई ये मैं प्रोसेस भू के आईएससीएस चाहिए इस पीछे दुईटा फुल पासपोर्ट साइज फोटो हई मेक श्योर यू हेव द टू पासपोर्ट साइज फोटो जो वाल ग्रेन में गए कि प्रिट इजी वालमट में भी होता ट्वेंटी डलर्स टेन डलर्स वट एवर कस्ट हई ते पे ते अर्क ओके दिस इज वेरी इंपोर्टेंट अब पर्सनल स्टेटमेंट अस पीछे सपोर्टिंग डकुमेंट पर्सनल स्टेटमेंट होने पर एक्चुअली यू हेव टू राइट लेटर सेंग वाई यू वॉन्ट इकोनोमिक हार्डसिप हई सो दैट इन तेस में डेमोस्ट्रेट कर पर्यटन मेरे चाहे काम छेन अलग मैं एफ एन स्टूडेंट में छू अथवा मेरे घर में टर्मिनल मेरे बुआ जो हिज 
who is a bread and butter of the family bread, uh, is terminally ill if you want to present that. But make sure then, if you are saying that, then make sure you have uh, the medical document too. If, if you are about bonomni or one, I'm saying, but if you are going to make, make sure you have substantial evidence to prove USCIS that you are actually the candidate that you are saying yourself. Right? So you are advertising yourself. This was the K Y. If you supporting document, ma kit you bani unsa hai na sample. This was the aru kya bani unsa ki unsa bani meru badi pahiro ayo. This was the ghar chahi meru kheti ma chahi rely karne ghar ko family hai na kheti pani gayo ghar ko amdani source of income is kahi na you bani unsa ki unsa. June lai supporting document kya bani unsa ki gavi samag gayo document le kaun. मेडिकल स्टैंडिंग If they already know that you are a good student, then they are more likely to help you. Okay? Uh, they are more likely to support you. So they will also write a recommendation. Okay? So I just want to make a quick revision. I seven six five. This was the updated I twenty with recommendation for employment. You say you say this go come when you do so like that. You don't have to worry about. It. You just go and talk the internet. Do that password says photo boy. This was the personal statement. You say literally like me after that, right? लेटर लेखे सपोर्ट करने डकुमेंट प्रोवाइड करने गवर्नमेंट डकुमेंट जो मैं मेडिकल डकुमेंट भो राखने ट्राई टू गेट रेकमेंडेशन फ्रम योर इंटरनेस डिरेक्टर विच इज बेस्ट बिकज दे आर द डीएसओ है अथराइज तिहार अप्रूव कर अप्रूव करे के नेक्स्ट स्टेप ओके अज अज तो अप्रूव तिहार लेखे रेकमेंडेशन राख आई नाइन्टी फोर हाई आई नाइन्टी फोर बेसिकली प्रूफ अफ लिगल स्टैटस Legal status for non-immigrating a uh, non-immigrating status at port of entry. Hey, I'm here actually. I'll <laughs> make sure I'm taking the right information. Basically, the I-94. dot cbps. dot dhs. dot gov. ma gov. Basically, passport number. I mean, after legal passport, ma jisse sa, the the information they have. Basically, the page din sa. If you don't have I-94, most of you must have I-94. Hey, I-94. So I know, I mean, online mode print gov. Ma jisse sa. So it's easy. I-94. Pani include gov. Ne. Hey, I-94. Pani include gov. Basically, ah, uh, aile sa. Hey. एक्चुअली यी अप्लाई करना चार सौ बीस डलर लगे जो एक्चुअली देर इज अ प्रोसेस टू डू अ वेबर फी टू विच आई एम नट गोइंग टक यू कैन गुगल इट इट्स अब तेज में फिर एक्स्ट्रा सपोर्ट चाहिए कि फिर चार सौ बीस डलर भी केंड कर सकिन भाई खाल सो दैट मिन्स अज फाइनेंसियली एकदम गाड़ो भाई खाल एविडेन्स प्रूव कर फी वेबर को एप्लीकेशन भी जो यू कैन डाउनलोड अभी तो पठाने में पठाई हो तर मोर लाइकली आई वुड Say four hundred twenty dollar pay for the hair is you are more likely your application would get reviewed. Not I'm trying to not discourage you. Hey, there are but more evidence signs. Okay, like it's okay. Say two four hundred twenty dollars from pay for the hair. Okay, you're excited. Okay, so basically, like the me poor work status the home so much. Okay, if you don't want to pay this four hundred twenty dollars, say four hundred twenty dollars, you can actually over this go one of like you can go to money order. Go even go Walmart one. So money order. You can go to. I don't know Western Union, right? They are going to basically pay to the order of U.S. Department of Homeland Security. One is like me. This was the poisa they are like me. It's easy. Only they are keen to pay. One is the employment authorization fee. One is like me. So you know U.S.C.S. Like it. Which I'm going to actually post a link from U.S.C.S. How do you how you should write in money order, right? All of this will be link post God means, right? So pay go pura aru ko. I will also post a sample for uh, EAD ko. The letter. It's not going to be Nepali letter, man. It's fine. It's fine. I'm just going to post random, my Google letter, search letter. Someone, a friend, student, hopefully, has written it. I know. Mainly, money, ideas. 
try to make it uh, terminal illness or natural calamity, which is the best idea. Terminal illness should be from the bread, okay? Money provider of the house, right? Most likely, Bua, Ama, to Mara, Mama, Sriti, Ailize, Maru, Biran, this how the paper money, right? Then, my money, paper money, this is a support money. Actually, it's happening, you pay for the guy, you said it's happening, you pay for money, you know? Uh, you this is the त्यो सबै मैले डकुमेन्टहरु भने नि i765 i94 i20 अपडेटेड वाला त्यस पछि दुईटा पासपोर्ट साइज फोटोस त्यस पछि पर्सनल स्टेटमेन्ट त्यस पछि सपोर्टिंग डकुमेन्ट रेकमेन्डेसन लेटर फ्रम दि योर इन्टरनेशनल डायरेक्टर है अनि जुन 420 डलर भन्यो त्यो सबै हालेर 420 I think YouTube put the description on right? And this with two gorgeous humans, I mean, Ekmina within one month, my own person, I think, within one week actually, received our own person. Received, Monego, notice of action, Monero, as Jolimony, USCS, J. Documents and Marabini, received answer, notice of action, Monego, notice of action, Monego, Japanese. Bloy Majitiro Poisa Pai, their document Pai, and you say their receipt number, you can track your document one and so in. Only their receipt number there, and so you don't know how much the receipt number right on the other. Receipt number one is a key one of the USCIS case status check one at Hamagur, receipt number and there is a key boy as a mere status case go one and check one. Take a visit you know, almost within one month of him, EAD card and the mailing address, Zoom address, my will have him as a two address my mail or in so. If you are F2 student, you can F1 status. You can change the proof. You can change the status. 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 You can change You can change the You can You can You and basically, you get received a paper almost three months. I am going to tell you what's legal, what you are legally telling you. You can actually work. The work it is still considered government, it is still 20 hours during college hours, college time. I mean, off time, 40 hours, you know, and, uh, but EADO, it's up to your choice, and uh, EADO, you see, you are basically, there's no obligation that you don't, you have no, you have right to work, right? Uh, but most of the time, I'm going to use very rapid, so, you know, but uh, technically, that's a legal answer that I have to put up, right? 20 hours in school and 40 hours in off, in break, you know, you uh, and at the end, very end, I, I just want to make sure that I'm telling the right information. The EAD process, actually, the EAD process the social security will simultaneously apply on the So actually, USCIS will send your information to actually the social security SSA for processing. So EAD, I go within two weeks, and social security will paper open also actually, without you actually going to social security office. This is uh, effective October 1, 2017. Eh? Um, so this is a new process. We have a new process. We have a new office. So this is a new change. Uh, you can actually read it on online too. In the USA school website. Na? But uh, that should be all. I think that's all the information you need for EAD process. Eh? And social security too, I guess. Eh? At the same time, if you want to. Other than that, if you have questions, uh, please post in the YouTube or the Facebook when you post on your live. I'll try to answer if I know. Uh, if not, I'll post the links. Right? And this will see, uh, you can actually go through the links. On that, something like happy holidays and Merry Christmas. Next time I'll come with me another video, hopefully, hopefully to F1 students.